Who's that teacher talking to Professor Quirrell? Oh, that's Professor Snape, head of Slytherin House. Who's the Half-Blood Prince? Who? That's what it says right here. Severus. Severus. Severus Snape. This book is property of the Half-Blood Prince. What's he teach? Potions. But everyone knows it's the dark arts he fancies. I can teach you how to bewitch the mind and ensnare the senses. I can tell you how to bottle fame, brew glory, and even put a stopper in death. Please. These are dark times, there is no denying. I was beginning to worry you had lost your way. Our world has perhaps faced no greater threat than it does today. It's the dark mark. Harry is his mark. He's back. Severus, Severus, please. We're friends. Feeling sentimental. Once again, you astonish with your gifts, Potter. Gifts mere mortals can only dream of possessing. How grand it must be to be the chosen one. Extraordinarily like your father you are, Potter. He too was exceedingly arrogant. Don't say a word against my father! And sentimental children forever whining about how bitterly unfair your lives have been. Well, it may have escaped your notice, but life isn't fair. Your blessed father knew that. In fact, he frequently sought My it. father was a great man! Your father was a swine! Snape's a part of the order. My lord. Go and find Severus. Bring him to me. It answers to you. This is what you call control. And you only. Does it? Have you ever heard of this spell? Perhaps you could give us the last unforgivable curse. Sectum Sempra. Avada Kedavra. Sectum Sempra! How dare you stand where he stood? You dare use my own spells against me, Potter. Tell them how it happened that night. I'm the half-blood prince. Tell them how you looked him in the eye, a man who trusted you and killed him. You've been a good and faithful servant, Severus. But only I can live forever. My lord. Take them. Take them. It's just empty words. He'll give it his best effort when it matters most. He'll just slither back into the hole. As a matter of interest, what were you thinking? The prophecy did not refer to a woman. It spoke of a boy born at the end of July. Yes, but he thinks it's her son. You were to keep her safe. The boy survives. This doesn't need protection. The Dark Lord is gone. The Dark Lord will return. And when he does, the boy will be in terrible danger. Hide her. Hide them all. I beg you. If you truly loved her... What will you give me in exchange? No one can know anything. I should never reveal the best of your Severus. Your word. When you risk your life every day to protect the boy. These people are trying to save me. There will come a time when Harry Potter must be told something. Must be told what? You must be the one to kill me, Severus. Swear to it. I swear to protect you. Make the unbreakable vow. Only then will the Dark Lord trust you completely. The boy must die. You've kept him alive so that he can die at the proper moment. Yes. You've been raising him like a pig for slaughter. Don't tell me now that you've grown to care for the boy. Accept the truth. I expect you're tired of hearing this. He has her eyes. And your mother, Lily's. Lily. He was the bravest man I've ever known. You'll stay with me. After all this time. Always.